A lot of elderly people really don't have people who can advocate for them and help them navigate the whole health care thing. Do you remember this one? Yes. And in talking with senior pharmacists, things can open up for them. How are you? Good. It's good to see you. We as seniors, we have worked all our lives, and a lot of us, we go without. I feel like that you should do the senior right because we have scuffled, and I know I have had a long, long, hard road. I really, really thank the senior program for being there for me. Senior Pharmacist is a unique nonprofit organization in Durham that really is centered on older adults with more limited incomes to help them be as healthy as possible, uh, really for as long as possible. We can help with Medicare, we can help find resources and navigate services, and we help pay for medications and help people understand their medications so they do more good than harm. Why do you take this one? Well, already now, I can tell you on some of these, the doctor told me. <laughs> One of the core services we provide is called medication therapy management. So we have pharmacists trained in geriatrics, and they meet people here in our office, and we provide transportation if need be. Uh, we go into people's homes if they're homebound, and we provide telehealth appointments. As a clinical pharmacist for senior pharmacist, my area of expertise is with medication therapy management. So I'll sit down with folks as they come in, talk to them about their health history, get a sense of what conditions they have, and then we'll talk about their medications one-on-one, -on -one, one at a time. Any problems getting dizzy or lightheaded? No. I've been coming here to senior pharmacist for many years. And the first part of the year, we go over my meds, how much I take, why I take it. Any problems tolerating this one? No. And at the end of the year, they really, really helped me <laughs> with choosing my Part D coverage. We call Medicare the equal opportunity confuser. So we have a group of gifted volunteers and our staff that do Medicare insurance counseling to really try to get some of the lingo out of it so that people can understand their basic choices. They explain line by line to you, so you're very clear about which one you want to choose. And they take care of sending it through. It's very helpful. When we help people with medications, you start hearing more and more about their quality of life and how, frankly, they need some support. We provide lots of referrals to different organizations in the community that can help people with things other than medicine, such as getting food, transportation, you know, anything that they might really need. Duke Family Medicine, this is Danya. Senior Pharmacist is an incredible community agency that as a social worker I utilize constantly. A lot of older adults are facing this issue where they have more and more costs piling up in their lives and fewer and fewer ways of paying for those costs. Okay, well it definitely seems like both of you are eligible to get seen at Senior Pharmacist. I think Senior Pharmacist does a really great job of looking at each person as a whole human and addressing their care in that way. Of course, these are the medications they are by the week. Many folks, even if they have Medicare D, are underinsured. So we pay the difference between their copay and what the insurance company, Part D plan, says they owe. At one time, I was paying like $222 for one vial of um, insulin. And please forgive me. Uh, my children had to help me get my medicine. This is me with my four children years ago. My doctor recommended me to the singing program to see could they help me. And now I don't have to ask my children to help me with my medicine. <laughs> it couldn't ask for a better program or better people. Okay. All right, bye. Our work is really about equity. We want older adults in Durham to thrive and know that they're valued um, by our community. They really are dedicated and committed to what they're doing and they care for people. And 
there aren't too many people around like that.